Holy crap, I don't even know where it is. We're going to need a few things to create a rocket. Not all these things were used during the making of this rocket, but most of the pieces were. We need three pieces of 20 inch long PVC pipe. Make sure you use the SCED 40 pipe as well. We're going to need two metal adapters, two valves, a T, an elbow, two bushings, reducing bushings, one water hose adapter, and one air hose adapter. We're also going to need some PVC glue and primer. The first thing you're going to want to do is put on your tee. Make sure that you apply primer and glue to both sides of the pieces, inside the tee as well. And insert our first piece into the tee. And then do the same for the other piece. Always make sure that you apply glue and primer on both sides. And we're also going to put on our third piece. The T is now completed. Next we're going to want to put our elbow on. Apply primer and glue on the elbow and on the end of your one pipe. When you're putting it on, make sure that your elbow is facing straight up. And we're also going to put a piece of two inch a two inch piece of PVC pipe in the end. That's where your bottle is going to be sitting on. Next we're going to tread on our metal adapters onto the valves. Make sure you use a little bit of paste. And we tread the metal adapter onto the valves and we do that two times putting the metal adapter on both valves. Next we're going to glue the valves onto the, the lengths of our pieces on both sides. And then you're going to want to put your hose adapter into the end of one side of the valves. Make sure you get it on real tight. You don't want it leaking all over the place. And on the other side, we're going to put our one bushing. Tighten it up. Put on our second bushing. We want to reduce the hole to your three quarter inch size so that we can put on our air compressor nipple. Both pieces are now on tight. Make sure that you always use a little bit of paste on the treads. And we're now going to put on the nipple. Tighten it all up and both our ends are done. This project is almost completed now. The last thing you want to do is use a drill bit and a nail. Make sure that your drill bit is about the same size as the nail and drill through the bottle and into the, the 2 inch PVC pipe that we glued on earlier. This is what can, is going to hold the bottle down until you pull on the nail to launch it up in the air. And there you go, we got a hole and our nail is now going to hold the bottle when we put pressure in there. You're going to want to tie your nail onto a little piece of string so that you can pull it out from a far a safe distance. Our piece of straight is now tied and there you go. This is how the project works. Nice and simple. This is what the project looks like when it's completed. Two valves on each end and one going out where the bottle will be launch up in the air. This is what it looks like with only water in it. It still goes fairly high but when you apply some air as well then it really launches.
Holy crap, I don't even know where it is. If you like this video, you may like some of the other projects we've completed. Visit our channel or visit our website at www.curious-howto.com.